Je m'appelle Christine Serré, je suis une chorégraphe basée à Montréal et j'ai fait la plupart de ma carrière en Europe, dans des compagnies de danse et aussi en tant qu'artiste indépendante. For this piece, Delightful Disruption, I really wanted to explore and reflect on the darker aspects of our human behavior, the more shadowy sides, and how that fits into a human being as a whole. Uh, we're constantly being pulled off track out of our inner peaceful states and um, we're disrupted and sometimes uh, the disruption is harsh, sometimes it could lead us into dark places, but sometimes the disruption uh, is important or essential for us to, to change or to shift perspectives and to allow us to, to grow. Yeah, better. Nice, that's better, yeah. For this piece, I have 12 incredible, beautiful dancers, with, each with their own uh, personality and individuality. So it's going to shift uh, depending on who I'm working with. A good direction, I think, to take. And then, and then you'll you know, adjust it within yourself so that it's, you feel good, you know. In this piece, uh, we have a few brief projections that will appear at certain moments in the piece. And I had the pleasure to collaborate with Patrick Peris, who is the filmmaker of Les Grands Ballets Canadiens. And right away, I think he understood the intention that I was looking for. And to explain the projection, I have to um, clarify that I, outside my work as a choreographer, I also work with seniors. So I uh, do adapted movement and creative movement in senior homes, in retirement homes, and I also work with seniors privately. So I've been working with Jean over the last year. She's a 98-year-old beautiful lady, and uh, I got inspired to integrate her into the piece. To me, she represents the lifespan, the human lifespan, and all the different facets and parts of our personality that we hold within us throughout our life. And she's also like an overlooking or shadowy figure uh, that creates the link between the youthful beauty of the dancers and the beauty that we hold within us throughout our life despite the aging body. So when Maria and I first met uh, on Zoom, she was in Vancouver at the time, we began to speak and to brainstorm about the costumes. And right away, I felt like we, we understood each other. We spoke the same language. We wanted something very simple, classy, elegant, black, different styles of shirts, of tops, of jackets, of pants, of skirts. And we tried to, to give it their each individual combination for each dancer. So for this creation, I chose to work with four composers, Johan Johansson, Hildur Guanadotter, the Axen Cloak, and Henry Purcell. I really like the, the contrast between all the different pieces that I, that I chose uh, to allow the spectator to be really transported by the energy, the atmosphere, and the, the different feelings that, that each piece conveys.